So this achievement is called Gobi Relics. It says find all mass cap stone fragments and take them to the ancient statue. So to even get to mass cap, you would teleport from Lum Lumbridge Lodestone and you know you would head south. Yeah, this is regarding Tusca. So you'll see Wizard Chambers right here and right click and teleport. So now you're on Tusca. So you know just you know surge all the way up here. Go through the world port uh world window. And let's start searching for the fragments. The crazy thing is they don't pop up on the mini map like there's no red dot so it's more like a, you got to search for them. So the first location is right here. And this is for reference, like you know from the the raid, you just all the way west, and it's gonna be right here, right? So you could take the stone fragment, and they say you could only collect two of these a day, which is kind of interesting. So yeah, there it is on the floor over there. I find that kind of odd, but I guess that's how they make you keep playing the game. So the second tablet is you know just south of that. A little south east ish and here's the second fragment right here all right so here's the third fragment right here and just for the reference the Nemi forest and it's right here so it'll look like that so if you see this little triangle it's right here all right let's find the fourth one okay so the fourth one is gonna be in Otot which is over here so to even get there you would have to talk to Ranger Carol which is right here and it has a little transportation symbol next to it so they'll ask where you want to go so go to Otot and yeah let's let's look for this fragment now all right so they say it's all the way to the northwest so let's see if it's true yep I see it here so go all the way to the northwest, and Kiersey is for reference, and this is it right here. So that's all stolen fragments, and now we got one more to go. We got number five. So for the fifth one, we need to go to Kanata. So we'll use that teleportation, and let's see where we gotta go. It says it's all the way to the northeast-ish area so let's see if we can go there yep I see it here all right so here's the last stone fragment and we now we got to give it to the ancient statue so now we got to go all the way back so you know just run all the way back to Ranger Bruce and you know you can go to back to Tusca portal just to make it easier because for reference just to make it simple Right, so the ancient statue is over here. So you just run past all the air utes. And the ancient statue is right here. They say only two can be given, so we're going to see. You feel a faint. You bear a fragment which gently hums with the spirit trapped within. The spirit of a lost Gobi who brings forth knowledge of a long afterlife to this race. The mortal Gobis must come to their final rest upon their release to serve their higher purpose. In times gone by the energy of these souls would be gone upon their kin, woven into magic rituals and incantations. But long since has this magic been forgotten, lost to the sands of time, and the spirits are left to wander their plane for eternity. This is how they will remain, waiting to be found until the, the Gobies remember how once they possessed powers of old. Alright, so let's try the first one. The anima of the planet, the very same anima which leaks from the wounds that this world has come to bear. With these wounds, while these wounds must be tended if 
the plan is to be is to mend the effects have not been so ruinous over many centuries the seeping anima formed constructs spirit guardians that roam this world's forests and plains while not sentient these guardians still strive to conserve the natural order of mascab according affording their protection to those that may not be able to protect themselves for eons the spirit guardians have wandered sleepily towards the great temples where they reach the end of the cycle and return the animal to its source all right let's see if it's true you feel a faint okay so yeah I, i'm assuming yeah you can turn them all in all right you possess a fragment of a vent one of the distributors of an anima that is the regrowth and ecosystem of the world the Govies were once an industrious people. Their ancestors carved out arteries and filled them with the planet's lifeblood pumped from the heart of the ancient temples. The vents were constructed along with th these pipelines as outlets, slowly releasing anima into the surroundings and allowing life to flourish. This is how life on mass cab is sustained, a fragile circle in which element is dependent on the next for its survival. The temples and vents were created by the gobies. The gobies need the flora and fauna to survive, and the wildlife in turn relies on the system the gobies created. The invaders pose a great threat to this delicate balance. If one pillar falls, so do the rest. Let's try the fourth. You hold the hands a fragment of falling, fallen from one of the great temples which scatter these lands. The temples are sacred to the Gobi people, but little do they know their history and importance to the planet's vitality. Long ago, this world was dying, its anima perpetually seeping from the wounds it endures. The Gobis of old were diligent and in tune with the world, thus constructed the great temples to plug their, plug the leaks where this anima escaped. But they do not just halt the flow of anima from the core, they also sought to reverse it using the temples to tunnel or to funnel energy back to the source. This tradition has been long forgotten, however, and the only replenishment comes in source of spirit guardians reaching the temples at the end of the pilgrimages. Alright, now let's use the last one. And there we go. That's how you get the achievement. You bring me a fragment of filled with dark energy unnatural twisted and corrupted oh we I, I we all know who this is this has come into contact with the water beast yakamaru a once great spirit on who roamed the rivers and sees a mask cab when tuska came she brought with her the air you the plague that plagued this land but many have not seen the true extent of their blight they are there are certain Air you that have harnessed far greater power than comes naturally to them, such as the known, such as those known as the Beast ma Master and the Shaman. The Shaman, in particular, weaves dread from magic, spreading corruption where he walks, warping the minds of his victims. The Spirit God in Yakamaru fell prey to this evil. No longer does it protect the inhabitants, but instead, like so many others, must serve the Air you Masters. Interesting. 